We all know that wearing the ghoul mask in Fallout 3 makes it so that feral ghouls won't be hostile towards the player character, and we see other examples of feral ghouls not attacking their non-feral brethren, like in the Tenpenny Tower quest or with Oswald the Outrageous, or even in the Come Fly With Me quest with Jason Bright. Feral ghouls don't attack their non-feral counterparts, but why? Well, based on dialogue with Roy Phillips, when he gives the lone wanderer the ghoul mask, it seems as though it has to do with the feral ghoul's senses. Roy warns the player to not get too close to the feral ghouls or they will sniff them out and attack. So it's it seems that if you look like a ghoul, you're good in most scenarios, and if you smell like a ghoul too, then you can get up close and personal with the feral beasts. And as non-feral ghouls look, and likely smell like feral ghouls, they're safe from any feral ghoul attacks. With that being said, there are cases of feral ghouls fighting with non-feral ghouls, but that's usually because either the feral ghouls feel threatened, or the non-feral ghouls performed a hostile act towards the feral ghoul. There you go.